you see anything like what we're seeing out of Dion? In what area? In this well, he got awful rid of his, program, and all of a sudden he's got 80 new players. And they're, <clears throat> yeah. Against a pretty good schedule, they're 3 0. Yeah, they, somebody asked me about him three or four weeks ago. Here's the thing with uh, Coach Sanders the thing that I don't know him, but here's what I like. He's going to do what he wants the way he wants to do it, and he believes in it, and he don't care what anybody else thinks. Now, he may be making more from Burger King and Aflac and whoever else, and it might not matter, which is all the power to him. But from a distance, what I see is this is what he believes in, and this is what he did. And um, I'm guessing that they would have to practice against each other all the time because their roster numbers would be down. But it's worked out for him. Now, I haven't really seen them play much. I saw him play a little bit at TCU, but I haven't seen him play anymore. But the part I did see is that his son is making a lot of plays, or is making a really good player, is making a lot of plays, and they're playing into his strengths. And I thought that was good. But um, it'll be great for our conference. Uh, but but uh, he certainly uh, proved that you can get rid of your whole team and bring a new team in and play good.